Princeton in the eighties when I was a grad. So eventually I did do my PhD. Yeah. Because when I got out of the army, you know, I had to decide what to do next. Mm -hmm. And I got in touch with Orly in the spring of 85. Mm -hmm. And I said, you know, remember me, I was the college senior you said should come to Princeton. Could I come to Princeton? Yeah. And he said, sure, come in the fall. And so that was that. And, yeah. uh, but then there was all this great stuff going on at Princeton. Yeah. You know, Dave Card was a young faculty member there. And I, uh, Bob Lalonde had finished his thesis a few years earlier. Bob had right. done this great work showing uh, that, it, you know, trying to estimate the effects of training programs and showing that you would probably need a randomized trial to get it right. Orly and David were doing great work on that. They had two papers in particular, the Ashenfelder 78, Ashenfelder and Card 85. Mm -hmm. Card's 88 paper was Sullivan. So I was just gobbling all that stuff up. I, I can't exactly describe why, but I just love that stuff. And I had this feeling like, you know, I would like to write papers like these. Yeah, yeah. And I, when, I, when I meet young people who want to go to graduate school, I kind of try to elicit that from them. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, tell me the papers you wish you had written. Right. right. I'd have been happy to be the author of, you know, Bob Lalonde's thesis. Yeah, yeah. Or any of the Ashenfelder card training papers. Mm. You know, I really mm. saw myself doing that. I was able to imagine myself doing that. Once I, initially, I, you know, you get to graduate school, you're clueless. So I had no idea. But then I took Orly's labor class. I actually took it twice. Mm. And... Um, you know, it was full of interesting material to me.